Amal Kumar sharing with you some questions from the test paper. Now this one is from polynomial functions, advanced functions. Okay, here is a question for you. The question is, while playing in the surf, a dolphin jumped twice into the air before diving deep below the surface of the water. The path of the dolphin is shown on the following graph. So that's the graph. Write the equation of the polynomial function that represents the height of the dolphin relative to the surface of the water. You can pause the video, solve the question and then look into my suggestion. So I just copied the question from the test paper. It is, while playing in the surf, a dolphin jumped twice into the air before diving deep below the surface of the water. The path of the dolphin is shown in the following graph. Write the equation of the polynomial function that represents the height of the dolphin related to the surface of the water. Now to answer such questions, we have to locate the zeros, right? So these are four zeros here. So zeros can give us the equation of the function. Since we need to find height, let me write down height here in meters, right? So that is height in meters and x-axis gives you time right so x x is, is time in seconds so let me write down this is time in seconds okay therefore we can write height in meters as equal to the factors are all linear right so the first one the scale is from 0 to 4 this one is at 2 right so the first factor will give you 0 at x minus 2 the next will give you at 6 right x minus 6 then we have x minus 10 and then 14, right? So x minus 14. Now most of the students will just write in factored form and they may forget to write a here. So that could be a mistake. So once you write a, then we are talking about not a family, but this particular specific function. Is that okay? To find a, we can use this point, which is y intercept at minus 3. So, so we know that h0 is equals to minus 3. We can substitute and find a. So we have minus, I mean, sorry, 0, minus 2. So we could write straight away. Uh, when you write 0 here, you get minus 6 times minus 10 times minus 14, right? So from here, we can find the value of a. So we can say a is equals to minus 3 divided by all these terms, correct? So which is 2 times 6 times 10 times 14, whatever, correct? So that is how you can get the value of a. So you can use your calculator, find this value, right? Uh, approximately, let me write it down as, we'll write in fractions itself, 3 over Let's calculate the denominator. It is 2 times 6 times 10 times 14, 1680. So it is minus 3 over 1680. So we get our function as height of the dolphin is equals to minus 3 over 1680 x minus 2 times x minus 6 times x minus 10 times x minus 14, right? So that becomes the function which represents the height of the dolphin relative to the surface of the water. Now, you should not be expanding this and wasting time in the test paper. That is kind of important to understand. Okay, I hope that helps. I'm Anil Kumar. You can subscribe to my videos and learn a lot. Thank you and all the best.